What's up, Castle Clashers? Nasty Nate here with Nastizzle Gaming, bringing you the last uh, Insane Dungeon episode for the moment, which is going to be 410. Wanted to get the three flames on that so I could start sweeping. So here is my attempt. Uh, I came in from the bottom here, Guardian Angel um, and the Frenzy froze those stun towers with the heroes. Made sure I stunned the heroes so they didn't kill me right away. Okay. And then I was hoping to take out the stun towers and kind of move to the left. Because um, normally anybody who went to the right was going to die. Uh, in this case, the procs were good. Um, pretty much destroyed the bottom half of that. And then eventually the heroes that went to the right um, ended up dying. Well, not even all of the Minotaurs survived. Um, and the people on the left, which would be uh, Spirit Mage and Valentina, kept going. So uh, it all happened really quick. And yeah, then I got the three flame. There's really nothing left to stop me. Uh, yeah, not going to lie. The, these heroes are kind of pay to play. Um, but I don't think they need it to be. And that's something that's kind of surprised me throughout these uh, insane dungeons is that I, you don't really need like the best heroes. You just have to get your heroes to work together. That seems to be like the most important thing because I was using teams before this um, to get the one flame, the two flame. Yeah, they were doing fine just using Druid and some other just normal heroes that, that anybody's gonna have. Um, but yeah, to get the three flame, I did get impatient and I went ahead and put my heroes in there that I thought were gonna be able to just take out enough stuff that it would be easy for the rest of my guys to clean up, which is basically what happened. Um, settling on that, that bottom point was really important. Um, that just seemed like a really good spot to come in. I was getting some very good results. Um, so, and as with many of these uh, dungeons, it seemed like after I spent enough time um, planning it out, seeing what heroes I was going to use, what path, uh, what drop point I was going to use, what spells I was going to use, what path I wanted them to take, you know, it kind of all fell into place over time. It just took a lot of uh, patience and perseverance. Um, but yeah, so eventually I knew it was possible, just had to get a little lucky, which I did. Took out enough towers, took out enough heroes to where uh, I wasn't going to get permastunned or just destroyed by some Atlantic Horror. So yeah, I am done with Insane Dungeon 4. So happy to be sweeping it. Um, 5, Insane 5 looks scary. Don't know when I'm going to be able to tackle that one. But this was a little accomplishment for me. Yeah, see me taking a screenshot there. I was pretty happy about that. Um, yeah, well, thanks for joining me on my struggles to Insane 410 Three Flame. Thankfully, I got there. Oh, yeah, it feels good to sweep. Man, without having uh, to do all this dungeon pushing, which I've been doing for the past, like, three weeks, it feels so empty. It really does. Like, every dungeon attempt I was putting in to trying to progress in these dungeons and now I just I just don't need to I just wait for my quest board and sweep away so it's kind of a relief and it also kind of leaves an empty feeling in me <laughs> so hopefully uh, I can get my heroes strong enough to take on insane dungeon 5 it's probably gonna be a little while before I can um, but we're working on it got a lot of heroes um, with the Enlightened that we're bringing up and this uh, this dungeon is definitely helping a lot especially since if you consider that I was only sweeping what was it um, not even not even insane dungeon it was the uh, expert dungeon 8 
Um, or was it, was it Expert 7? I don't know, but a month ago I was super behind and I decided I needed to make the push. So I went ahead and just started upgrading my heroes, which had kind of been just chilling for a while after I took that break. Uh, and then I just started pushing and uh, I got there. So mission accomplished. And that sweep has been helping so much with the experience. It is such a benefit. Um, so if you can push to 410 and get those sweeps, it is, it's just worth it. It really is. Um, yeah, that's about all I have to say about that. So this was just my personal journey, not really a guide. Uh, just talking about how I personally made it through these dungeons. Um, basically posted the ones I had struggles with. Some of these were like super easy, like I couldn't believe it, like first attempt, three flame, or you know, or at least getting one flame on one attempt, two attempts. Um, yeah, but the ones I posted were the ones I was really struggling with. Um, yep. That's about it, guys. Thanks for watching. More to come soon. Nasty Nate out. Peace.